What's up YouTube, JP here, and I thought I'd do an update video on the PlayStation 2 emulation for Xbox Series S and X, because there's been a few changes. But before we jump into that, just want to give a shout out to my channel members for their continued support. Right, on with the video. Now normally I would just update the links on the video, and anyone that asks in the Discord server just post the new links there. But things have changed slightly, so let's jump over to the Xbox to see what's happening. So if you use the last link that we updated, you probably were met with a screen like this. So let's take a look at the new link that we're gonna be using. Now the link will be in the description below. Also, you'll be pleased to know that you no longer have to change your location to Brazil. Now unlike the last link, we don't actually go to a website. So if we to type the link in and click open, it takes us to the Microsoft page. Now even though this is actually EtherSX2, but it's been rebranded. It's got the PlayStation logo and it's called XBSX2.Xbox One. Now, once it's installed and you launch the program, you'll be greeted with this screen. Now, this should be very familiar to you if you've used EtherSX2 in the past. So there's two things we need to set up here. We need to go to settings, game list options, and then add a new search directory. So exactly the same you did before. Go into the D drive, go into games, go into PS2, use this directory. And then once you're back out of that, you'll see it starts searching for all the games. And then, of course, we're going to add the BIOS and do this exactly the same way as you did the games. Go to D drive, go to your BIOS folder and then use this directory. Right, we're all done. So let's quickly launch a game just to make sure everything's working. So we've seen a few changes. They've changed the icon and the name of the application, but in essence, it's still EtherSX2. It's just been repackaged. And of course, it's also a bonus so that we don't have to change our location to Brazil anymore. We can just leave it at whatever your standard location is. And don't forget, if you do need any other help, just join the Discord server. There's over 60 members in there now, and everyone is really friendly and helpful. So I'm going to end the video here. As always, if you enjoy my content, please like, subscribe. We will be giving away a PlayStation 5 Disc Edition when we hit 5,000 subscribers. So you've got to be in it to win it. I'm JP, you've been watching Alien Retro Gaming, and I'll catch you in the next one.